What is up guys, Donica 7 here bring you a brand new Halo MCC challenge guide. Today we're taking a look at Because You Begged, this is to perform an assassination against an elite to survive a fall that would have been fatal in Halo Reach's campaign to earn the Mr. Chief Mariner Helmet. This is indeed the return of the infamous Halo Reach achievement if they came to hear me beg, which was very buggy in a sense because sometimes you would hit the assassination but it wouldn't give you the achievement and so on and so forth, and the same thing happens here in Halo Reach on MCC. For this challenge guide, we're going to go into the Pillar of Autumn, starting at Rally Point Alpha. I actually recommend playing on Heroic Difficulty over Normal Difficulty, so take that into consideration. I know I show Normal Difficulty here in this intro scene, but about an hour and a half of nothing on Normal working for me, I ended up swapping over to Heroic, thinking, hey, maybe it's less likely I'll get the, the um, just back melee on him and I'll actually get the assassination animation. And about a half hour after that, it finally worked for me. So I would recommend doing this on Heroic over Normal Difficulty. You can see here I'm lining up with this rock that's to my right and then a meal to my left. And I'm kind of sprinting off the cliff, jumping at the last second between those two. And I'm trying to go for where the Elite would be standing next to the truck. Now, the truck isn't the only place where the Elite can stand next to. He can sometimes make his way all the way up towards the bridge, and sometimes he's standing next to the um, semi-truck trailer. Now, you can see there, I did jump off and get the assassination on that time, but unfortunately, the game didn't give me the unlock. Other times, you can see are I don't make the jump to him in time, or I should say he gets too far away from me, and then there's times where he just starts walking away as I'm mid-jump. Here is the jump that finally got me the challenge completed. The way I land, you can see the reticle didn't actually go red until I was right next to him, and that was a split second of it being red. I ended up actually hitting start because of such force of habit of me always hitting start as soon as I fail it and hitting revert to last checkpoint. But surprisingly, after about two hours, I was able to get the challenge complete. And I will show some more gameplay of different angles that I recorded in theater mode of me coming down and assassinating the Elite. What I seem to think happened here was with this time for me, the Elite, say for example, he was facing north. When I came down and landed next to the Elite, I kind of landed to his southwest. And like I said, the reticle wasn't red until I was exactly behind the Elite. And I think that is the time is when you want to actually try and get the assassination on him. You don't want to land, obviously, on top of the Elite. That will actually kind of brace your fall, in a sense. You want to make sure you land on the ground as you're trying to do this. You don't want to land on the Elite. You don't want to bounce off the Elite. You don't want to land fully to his side. You can see here, I'm landing to his back left, pretty much. And I'm just getting the animation immediately, and it's dragging me right to his center. I think this is pretty much it. That angle right there with the top down is probably the best way to try and understand the view of coming down on top of the Elite. I hope these angles are somewhat helpful for you guys, and this video was helpful as well. Remember, if it was, leave a like, comment, and subscribe so I know you guys enjoyed the video. I know this challenge is going to be a pain in the butt. Have patience. You will get it eventually. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.